Mariner of the Seas features an overview is coming up next. Planning for a cruise full of fun from Orlando? If yes, then here are the 10 must-hit things to know before boarding Mariner of the Seas. One of the Voyager-class cruises by Royal Caribbean, it made its maiden voyage in 2003 and was later enhanced in 2018. On board, you will enjoy a sky pad, an escape room, a rock climbing wall, flow rider, and there are multiple bars and dining venues with 3,344 other guests. The itinerary includes two to eight nights of sailing from Orlando to the Bahamas, Bermuda, Western, Eastern, and Southern Caribbean. Talking about the decks, on deck two we have Royal Theater's lower level and a conference center. Deck three, the front is the theater, moving aft is the Studio B, and further back is the art gallery and the dining room. Deck four forward is the upper level of the theater. Towards the aft is the Schooner Bar, a great venue with piano music and wine. On the port side is Azumi, a Japanese dining venue. Further back is Casino Royale and its bar. Moving towards the centrum, you will find Boleros, a Latin pub on the port side, while Starbucks is on the starboard side, and at the back is the dining room. Deck five is the Royal Promenade. Here at the forward is the Star Lounge, which holds a lot of fun activities. Next to it is the library. Moving back, you will find the Cafe Promenade, which is a complimentary venue for coffee and snacks. Playmaker Sports Bar and Arcade will serve you bar food and the best drinks with your favorite sports telecast. You can enjoy the ice cream from the ice cream parlor, chilled beers in an English pub, and shopping from the retail. Apart from these, there is a bamboo room, a Polynesian bar, next cruise, shore excursions, as well as guest services. And the aft is reserved for the dining room. Finding this info helpful? Then please share. Decks 6 to 10 are reserved for staterooms. For some fun, check out the deck 11. Here on the forward side, there is a gym and Vitality Spa is on deck 12. Moving towards the aft on deck 11, you'll find Solarium, an adults-only venue with pools, hot tubs, and a bar. Moving back are the two main pools with hot tubs and Boardwalk Doghouse on the right. Towards the back is Jamie's Italian, an Italian dinner venue, and Chop's Grill, a specialty steakhouse. At the end is the complimentary Windjammer Buffet. Deck 12 is the home to Sky Lounge, a running track, as well as Adventure Ocean for kids. It also houses a nursery, a teen disco, an arcade, as well as Johnny Rockets, a specialty burger venue. Deck 13 has Mariner Dunes Mini Golf, and there is a rock climbing wall, a sports court, sky pad, sky climber, the perfect storm water slide, as well as flow rider. You will find the Viking Crown Lounge on deck 14, which also houses a suite lounge and the Diamond Club. And deck 15 hosts the Escape Room, a great fun venue. The accommodation options include interior, ocean view, and balcony. And there are luxury grand and royal suite options as well. Overall, you will enjoy being on board the Mariner of the Seas.